Are buyers getting burnt out? And if so, what does that mean for sellers and how the market is going to move forward? We are gonna talk about that today in our weekly market update. So, in the five cities of Temecula, Marietta, Menifee, Wildemar, and Lake Elsinore last week, we had a total of 209 new listings that was up 18% to the week prior. We had 206 accepted offers, pending sales, that was down 12% to the week prior, and we had 208 closed sales, which was down 6% to the week prior. Now, something that I am hearing across the board, it's not 100%, but a lot of buyers are getting burnt out. Um, prices keep going up. They're, um, they're, the number of homes that they have available to them is decreasing and they're writing offer after offer after offer and especially if they don't have somebody who's really um, strategic for them and is not getting them that yes um, and they're getting tired and they're getting a little burnt out. And so I am hearing from other friends of mine um, out in the market that that folks are, um, if they don't have to get in a home right away, they are pausing for a bit. They're taking a beat. They're breathing for a beat. And honestly, I, you know, I don't blame them. <laughs> um, this can be a little bit daunting. And um, if you don't necessarily have the right advocate for you, it can be discouraging. So what does that mean for sellers? Well, it does mean that, um, maybe you don't have as many showings as you had before you're not having as many offers as you did before it's still hot to trot out there but we are detecting somewhat of a change so just something to watch is the atmosphere changing out in the real estate market be aware of it really be watching that if you are thinking of uh, putting your home on the market and moving out of state uh, then you might want to consider doing that soon now, if you're putting your home on the market and you're staying locally, it, it doesn't really matter because you're going to kind of even out one way or the other anyway. So don't worry about that. But there you go. If you have any questions and you want to pick my brain about what's going on with the market, I'm going to be watching it every week, of course, and I'd be delighted to answer your questions. Have a great week, everybody. Hey, so if you liked this video, like it. If you loved it, make sure to subscribe so you can keep getting these market update videos and other great videos as well.